People in modern times use energy to fulfill their daily needs. They use energy for lighting, cooking, transportation, and so on. Currently, our high demands for energy are primarily served by fossil-based energy sources. Fossil-based energy sources are basically fuels formed by natural processes of decomposition of dead organisms, which could take millions of years to form. These processes produce varieties of energy sources such as coal, natural gas, and oil. However, the extremely long time to process this kind of energy resources presents another problem. All currently known viable reserves are being depleted much faster than new ones are being made. Fossil-based energy sources could also bring harmful and disastrous effects to the environment. The burning of fossil fuels could produce large amount of carbon dioxide, which is well known to contribute to global warming. That's why sustaining environment by using renewable energy sources is preferred. At the same time, we could save energy in our daily lives to create a better living. ASEAN is home to an economic zone of around 629 million people. The demand for energy is huge due to the economic growth in the region, with the average annual real growth rate of 5.3%. The total electricity demand growth is 5.6% per year between 2013 and 2035. It's time to diversify the energy matrix and meet the growing demand in a sustainable way. That is why the 10 energy ministers of ASEAN agreed upon the ASEAN Plan of Action for Energy Cooperation, also known as the APAIC 2016-2025, which sets a target of 23% share of renewable energy in total primary energy supply by the year of 2025. As for energy efficiency in the region, the ASEAN member states are also committed to achieve a 30% reduction in energy intensity by 2025. Renewable energy coupled with energy efficiency are crucial for energy security in Southeast Asia. Against this backdrop, ASEAN and Germany are working together on promoting renewable energy and energy efficiency. There are eight activities that ASEAN and Germany work on together. Enhancing renewable energy policies in ASEAN. Promoting benefits of renewable energy and energy efficiency in the region. Supporting the development of renewable energy project financing. Empowering the research and development network on renewable energy in ASEAN. Supporting exchange on grid integration. Developing the fifth ASEAN energy outlook. Developing regional green building code for new and retrofitted buildings in ASEAN. And developing energy efficiency financial support mechanism in ASEAN. Everyone needs to take part. Governments, project developers, banks and financial institutions and utilities shall work together to truly realize sustainable energy in ASEAN. As part of ASEAN community, we can take part as agents of change in raising awareness of renewable energy importance. We can save money by using energy efficiently in daily life. Together with ASEAN German Energy Program, jointly implemented by ASEAN Center for Energy or ACE and GIZ on behalf of the German Federal Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development or BMZ. So, let us move together, hand in hand, and walk towards realizing sustainable energy for better living conditions in ASEAN. Mm -hmm.